all right what's up trigger2295 here and today i'm gonna be showing you guys how to find the youtube uh, dimensions for a youtube background uh so what i'm gonna do here is open up your browser All right, when your browser's opened up, go to YouTube. All right, uh, first off, by the way, this is my other channel, TMP2295. But what you wanna do now is go to some famous channel. Uh, I'll just go to it, I pick, and I'll go to phases. Because I've noticed that a lot of people who wanna make a YouTube background that looks you know cool like on photoshop or what i use gimp it's literally the same thing i like it but yeah um but there are a lot of gamers that like to make these so i'll just use two of the most famous clans so i'll use optic first i'll just look up All right, click on the channel, and again, you could probably use any uh, any channel, but I'm just gonna use optic and faces for now. I'm gonna mute this ad. Okay, so what you want to do is right-click on the background here and view background image. All right, so it'll pull up this page, this Y3, I3 dot Y, T, M, G, dot whatever. Okay, after that, you right click and view image info. And then from here, you'll find the dimensions right here. So their background is uh, 2000 by 2070. So now we're gonna go to phases and see what theirs is. And actually, I looked theirs up a little bit ago. Theirs is the exact same. But I just wanted to show you that it's like pretty much the perfect, um, if you want to say, uh, dimension. So we got phase. All right, right click the background just like you did before. View background image. Here's their layout. So, right click, view image info, 2000 by 2070. Just wanna go back to their page. You see that like nothing is cut out at all. Maybe a little corner on the F, that's it. So, yeah, I'm gonna close that out now. So what I did, I just took those dimensions, put them into a folder I made on my desktop and put optic gaming I put dimensions right here um, that's about it so I hope this tutorial helped uh, don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and keep checking back for more videos and tutorials and all that fun stuff and yeah that's about it all right